with a piece of music. It's an idea behind it, a, 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 a mahukhan, a feeling, an emotion. It comes from what I call behind the black doors of the mind. Something forces me to dip into it and pull it out. I love the sound the barbs on each hair of a bow makes as it pulls on a string. I think it's the essence of interface of music, like between the physical reality and creativity, because the touch of the human on the bow uh, defines that sound and makes it something extraordinary. You know the way in Irish people say that person is lovely Irish? Mm. And in English, that person is a lovely English means an entirely different thing. It doesn't happen. It doesn't happen. It's and it's not just vocabulary, it's like, it's the detail of pronunciation and... and um, Imagery. Yeah. My feeling is that if the person goes into the place mm. where, where good music happens, the world of feeling, the interior world of that musician, and, and the place they go to when they just touch that note, that, that in some way, whether they play it differently than the score or not, like the, the point is that there's a power behind this music. Western music, there isn't that much improvisation because by definition its form will not take variation. Whereas in Irish music, variation is the rule. Like our tune, it's the starting point. And it's what you do to the tune as you play through it, your own subtle variations that create the art in the performance. Yeah, our brains are flat. Mm -hmm. 